Today we will be building letters using Play-Doh and Play-Doh mats. The items that you'll need are Play-Doh, any color, and your Play-Doh mat. If you do not have a Play-Doh mat, that's okay. Take a blank piece of paper and you can write the letter that you're planning on building with your Play-Doh on top of that. The Play-Doh may stick to the paper and that's okay. Um, Cause you can throw away the paper afterwards. So the first thing that you're gonna wanna do is depending on the letter, you will tear apart your Play-Doh into that amount of pieces. So we'll do the letter A today. So we have our big line, big line, and little line. So we'll need to tear our Play-Doh into three pieces. One, two, three. So I have one, two, and three pieces. We can put two pieces to the side as we start with our first one. And I'm going to roll it out. And I want you to practice rolling it out using a flat hand with your fingers kind of extended like that, okay? So we're working on strengthening our muscles on the outside of our hand right now. And some of the muscles in our arms by rolling out this Play-Doh. Okay, so we have one, we have one big line. And we're gonna roll out the second big line. I'm trying to make them the size of the page or the, pa the letter that's on the page. Two big lines and our little line. So now we build our letter like it's written down here. So we have our big line down, jump up, Big line down, little line across. So we put our big line down, jump up, big line down, and little line across. And we have built our A. To help with additional fine motor skills and building those muscles, we can pinch the letters on the side. So what I'm looking, what we're looking for here is pinching with our finger and our thumb. And that builds all of the little muscles in our hand that help with our pencil grasp. So we pinch along, frog jump up, pinch along, frog jump up and across. Um, another activity that you can do with this is have them push it down. Push, push, this helps with finger isolation, so using only one finger at a time, and also building the little muscles in their hands and arm. Push, jump up, big line down, slide down, front back up, and little line across. So now we have our A in a couple of different ways. Um, underneath of that is where we'll practice writing our A. So ideally you'll have a laminated piece of paper and you can have a dry erase marker. Again, if you don't have that, that's okay. You can just use a regular piece of paper. So we're gonna practice by tracing this one first. Start at the top, big line down, frog jump up, line down, and little line across. I'm looking for a nice, good pencil grasp. Line down, frog jump up, line down and across and just have them continue practicing their letter formation, building the letter that you're working on. And that is how we make dough letters.